Hello everyone, today is July 15th, 2016. I'm in a parking lot in the town where I live. And this is the first time that I've seen a mobile mammography vehicle. So I'm going to try to zoom in on it. You can see it's a local hospital here. And I guess you can go up and I guess you can get what I refer to as a slamogram is it's like they slam your boob into a vise to get a picture of it. I have never seen one of these vehicles. I bet it's expensive too. That looks like an RV, a really nice RV. But I'm just thinking, you know, in this part of town, this is sort of a, it's a nicer part of town, but, um, you know, Walmarts are everywhere and more wealthier sides of town and more poorer sides of town. They're just everywhere. But let's say you're a, a, a poorer person and you want to get one of these and you find out you have cancer. What are you going to do anyway? If you don't have any money or any insurance and you have cancer, breast cancer, they're going to tell you you have cancer and then you're going to be like, well, I don't have any money to go get any treatment for it. So I'm not sure what, the, the, what they're trying to do here. Um, I guess maybe to remind women who haven't had a mammogram, oh, you better get one, we're here to help you. I don't know. I don't think mammograms are good for you. I mean, I, I don't know. I think they actually cause breast cancer. It's such a deep, a deep, you know, image and, and I, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't feel good about them. But I'm sure they save some, some women's lives. Um, but I've never seen a vehicle like this. Um, it's definitely a first. I guess these are nurses here or someone Got a little laptop, getting your data, collecting your data. Data collection, another example of data collection, too. Wow. Have you guys seen these before? Let me know. I'm curious. Have a great day.